What is poppin' everybody? It is your boy Victor Dawson and we are back with a never have I ever for you. Never have I ever boom. Never have I ever would you ever get into it. Ooh. Anyway, we are going to be watching episode, no, we're going to be watching season one, honey, episode three of Never Have I Ever, because honey, like I said, we're trying to get these out for you. We're trying to get these out before the next week come with the new episode. So without further ado, honey, if you like anything, anything when it comes for reactions, this is the channel for you. So hit that bright red subscribe button, hit that like button and hit that little bell. So you know, every time I post, sweetie, don't get it twisted. Well, we left off last episode, honey, um, Debbie was trying to have this little sex day it didn't work in her favor and we met Paxson's little sister who was giving fashion honey giving old navy fashion yes and um what else did we see oh um Kamala got her new little boy toy honey that she don't want to have a relationship with because she want to do this arranged marriage and all that nonsense so that was the cliff notes version if you didn't look at it honey you need to go look at the reaction that I posted before honey yes get into it and let's roll this intro so we can get into this episode shall we Right, you guys we are back and we are ready to get into episode three honey get your snacks get your water get whatever you need to get to get your gig and let's get it uh oh we're giving red dress yes by the time we see fabiola in something this is giving stiff but i'm here for it oh yes we change come on now come on uh, -uh look at mama look at mama look at mama look at mama <laughs> and they still into it, honey. They still in a choreo. Oh. <laughs> First of all, why you got on makeup? Oh, so mama is a dermatologist. Okay, doctor. Three minutes. And the boy must eat now. Oh, not a basic step, mom. Like it? No, not yet. The truth is, Paxton and Davy were kind of nothing. Mm. Don't sweat it. Has he introduced you to his friends? No, but that's cool. He's a shame. Girl, no. You need to tell your friends the truth and stop making them feel all these other things. That's why I hate all men. Mm -mm, honey, she want that woman. She want a div in the lady pond. Oh, y'all need to talk to each other and tell each other the truth. Uh, why mama said I him once you do this? This look like it ain't been touched since daddy was alive. A tomato? Shit, she don't want to be reminded of that. Oh! Whoa, had he seen her sexy dance video and changed his mind? Uh, uh, uh not you leaving your friend group. Cool. I'll be in your group too. Cool. Okay, Paxton. Work alone. I don't want anyone diluting the quality. I'm not diluting the quality. Oh, James, like we're gonna have to have one foursome. So how about both Ben and Eve? Why don't you go join Eleanor and Fabiola? Presentations are. She don't want Eve Monday. to be a part because, <laughs> honey, Eve yeah, is sure. her little crushy crush. Yeah. Wait, I missed it. Steve. Hi. Mm -hmm. I got one. You know, I was just at the Cheesecake Factory for lunch. Ordered our usual. Loaded baked potato tots. Hold the bacon. Yeah. Couldn't finish it though. I've been such a mess about her breakup. Well, that and also the portions are insane. I saw someone eating pasta out of a bucket. Delicious. It is bullshit. That's exactly what it is, honey. It's time for somebody to step above the mold. Oh. Let me just say this. I can't believe that a woman who was brave enough to travel halfway around the world to pursue her dreams would allow anyone to dictate who she could right. be. Ben. Oh my goodness, all that swimming is giving you some muscles. If your prom day cancels on you, you know where to find me. At the nearest wine bar. <laughs> Thanks, I'm not too worried though. I've been going to prom since seventh grade. Oh, bet you could pick me Uh-uh, wait a minute. Your project. Not mama trying to be nasty. And it does it. Girl, okay. you clearly gonna be carrying this project. We're brainstorming. I actually have some ideas too. Awesome. Let's see what you got, little Lady. Lady. Holy shit! Did Paxson HY just give her a nickname? You don't do that unless you plan on referring to that person a ton in the future. That bouncing's. Uh oh, -uh, girl, you really thought he was there and giving you a nickname because he had a little crush? I a cute bird. What's your favorite bird? 
I guess a chicken? Fabiola. And hello to you, Gears. Come on, Fabiola. Give it very much Which academic achievements. With these new complicated yeah, she like her. She like that. Mm-hmm. Mama, all she want is Oh. Uh no, it's not. High school is about learning, education, and drama. Yes, Riverdale. Buckle up for some steamy teen romance project and he gives you It means he's putting you in that friend zone, honey. That's what it means. But does it mean he wants to be mm -mm, honey, that ain't what it means. Why are you asking me? I don't know anything about boyfriends. Mm. Oh my god! Graham! Get out of my dad's garden, you lousy coyote! Girl, why you out there under that coyote like that, honey? You need to be behind the door, honey. Ain't them crazy? But she couldn't deny looks professional. Um, all I saw was a little picture and a little description on the side, honey. We could do that on PowerPoint right now in five minutes and get a high A. Oh my goodness. Girl, you are carrying this whole project and assignment. Out of person hiding inside the feed. Con, put in your address and you'll find a bunker in your neighborhood. If one is available. That can't be the slogan. The slogan sucks. We have to help the Jews escape the Nazis. <laughs> That's brilliant. And no, it's not. It's an app that tells a stranger the exact location right. of the Jewish people and sends a card to round them up. Whatever. It's a good idea from the smartest person in the room. And you're all hating on it because you're anti-Semitic. Halloween, she did a couple's costume with a librarian. I mean, this is pretty classic dork behavior. Oh, yeah? Would a dork be sleeping with Paxton Hall Yoshida Ooh. from school? Uh, She's giving very much Valentine's oh, Day. We're going to sit in his hot tub and sing mm -mm. at each other. Bye, queens. Interested. Why would you invite me to that? Because I thought you might be into it. Why didn't you invite Eleanor and Ben? I don't know. They were sort of a lot, and I thought maybe... I think that you have the wrong idea about me. Do you mind going to the store and buying me... Uh-uh! -uh. My mom won't buy them for And me. you think you she asking your therapist for a thong? A rhinestone phrase on the front that says do me. I will not be buying you a turkey <laughs> ass phone. Fine. I'll just cut the cheeks out of my normal underwear. Whatever. But no. He came to me mm. as a coyote. Excuse me? Are you going to be weird about this? Okay. Well, if you see that coyote again, I want you to talk to him. Tell him what you're feeling. Need to tell your mama, your child trying to go to a little rager. Actually, I have a chore of my own that I have to do. Not the stockpile. Mama said, what you not going to do is embarrass her name. Whoa, Davey, you came. You brought California brittle. This slaps. Come in. Mm -mm. You want a drink? Oh, yeah. Bear me. Love that bread soda. <laughs> it's all right. You're a weird girl. Hey, I don't know what any Child, she getting these mixed emotions. She getting these mixed feelings. Flirty touching? In my day, if you like someone, you pointed to them in the stands and they threw their bra at you. This? I don't know what this is. You yeah. go to the same eye doctor. Next to Chipotle. What's up, people? Who wants some za? Some za. Hands on two fingers. <laughs> You're one to talk. How are you even here? These people don't like you. Yeah, they do. Hey, what's up, Trent? Oh. Whatever. Who's all my vodka crayons? Not her vodka crayons. Paxton and Zoe. It's pretty hot couple, huh? It's only hot from the boobs down and the chin up, but her neck is kind of busted. Actually, had a shot with him. Wait, she do got a shot with him now, right? With narrator, calm down, girl. Do not talk to that coyote right now. What are you doing? Don't worry, he won't hurt me. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not gonna do it in the morgue. Do what in the morgue? Mm -hmm. Um Paxton is showing mixed emotions because honey, you taking me to the hospital, you being super nice, but then when we get around people, you acting like a little douchebag. Like what do you mean? Yeah. Everyone oh Jesus. Died. Let's take a pick. I don't know you're good. Uh oh, see tagging on social media. What were you thinking getting so close to that coyote? This is gonna sound insane, but I thought it was my 
stepdad. We have been waiting for. And that's why it's cool. We're friends. Ooh. Friends. Ouch. Mama, you got friend zoned. God damn it, baby. Mm -mm. Uh oh, -uh, not walking HP. <laughs> Mom. Paxton was just trying to help your daughter while she out here lying. Why Jersey Mar Mike's got to be involved? Until the day your kids graduate. Oh, Jesus. The Cheesecake Factory. Oh my gosh, honey, no. I stopped listening after you said you wanted to. Aww. Girl, tell everybody, honey. They looking like they are not thrilled. It's an atomic bomb. So get out of town. But don't go to Nagasaki. Middle of the Blitzkeg. Blitzkrieg. How do you find a safe place to hide so that you don't get exploded? With Bunker, you can locate safe spots to hide within your neighborhood. Whether it's from a German bomber or... Or a coyote. Woo! Coyote mm -hmm. girl. Yeah! Coyote girl. These nicknames. One minute she you in, next minute she coyote girl. Ooh, high school, honey. Uh-oh! Not the over the shoulder, honey. Not him giving you some attention. Oh. Come on, Fabiola. Hey, Tiffany, you want to go to yogurt line after school? If we get enough samples, we can squeeze them into a big cup. Mm-mm. Sick. Dang, he got him a new girl. Ooh, that's high school, honey. Off to the next. What you about to say? Come on, girl. Come on. Come out, mama. It's going to be okay. Yeah. She in a lady pond. She in a lady pond. Girl, going to get you a woman, honey, and be happy and fine and fantastic. That's what I'm here for. Come on, episode. Ooh, y'all, these little episodes are giving me life. We never have I ever. I like this little show. We got Fabiola coming out, honey. She is admitting that she is gay, honey. Yes, girl. And go get Eve, honey. Go get Miss Eve, honey. Eve giving me very much villain on Camp Possible. Villain on some Disney Channel cartoon show, The Replace. <gasps> y'all remember The Replacement? Eve is giving replacement. <laughs> Let me stop, y'all. Let me stop. I need to be drinking me some coffee, y'all, because I'm getting a little tired. But I was here for episode three. Paxton is Paxton is showing mixed signals to me. Paxton, one minute Paxton is all about being friends with her. The next minute he is, you know, showing that he's like this douchebag type of character. And I mean, it's typical high, high school boy stuff, but my girl Davy is getting too confused, honey. She don't know if you friend zoning her or if you really liking her because honey that chivalrous thing that you did and pulling her up in the jeep because she got bit by that coyote who she thought was her daddy that was very chivalrous honey one of her oh her friends wasn't there that's right well he is a good guy at the end of the day i guess so even though he's somewhat of a douchebag with those with those weird friends he is a good guy at the end of the day. But I was here for the little episode, honey. What else did I take from this episode in episode three? What was mama given? Uh, just the standard, you know, strictness. And, oh, yes, come on, Kamala. Um, yes, mama, get your coin and get your man. And go ahead, go ahead and tell everybody, what are you hiding from? I mean, arranged marriages is clearly your plot line this season. And, um... I hope by the end of this season you are tired of arranged marriages and you're tired of that thought and you have decided to be with your man and y'all are going to give what needs to be given and be in a, uh, in a great interracial relationship, honey, because I love me an interracial couple, honey. I'm just always here for the culture. So let me know what y'all thought of this episode. Let me know the key notes that y'all thought and we can talk about it in the comments below. If you like this video, please hit that bright red subscribe button and hit that like button, honey, and also hit that bell so you know every time I post and follow me on all my social medias at Victor A. Dawson, and I will see y'all at the next Never Have I Ever episode reaction. Bye, guys.